So I did a, uh, it's not a photo, it's a video. I uh, gave my parents a uh, Christmas present a couple years ago. I think it's got tens of 20 million views or something like that. Um, it's probably still still giving my parents that, uh, that gift for Christmas a couple years ago. I have a lot of um, professional fishermen. Actually, I'm a big, a big fisherman guy. And um, so I've, I've met a few um, throughout you know, my time of um, fishing and I got some photos on Instagram. I got a country singer that's pretty famous, a professional fisherman. I'm trying to think of anybody that we would definitely know. Um, no one that, that somebody would know off the top of the head, but uh, yeah, just some professional guys like that. Quite a bit. Um, not, as, not as much being, being out here. Um, if I go back in, to Gainesville or back in my hometown, I, I definitely get recognized a lot more than, than being out here, being in different um, cities across the country. Um, my hometown, I'm back in Florida um, quite a few times, but nothing, nothing crazy to where I can't walk in somewhere or anything like that. Favorite movie is Talladega Nights. Mm, it's still got to be Talladega Nights. It's the best one I've ever watched. Love it. I'm going to stick with the, the one that I've always loved is Eric Church. Uh, Luke Combs for sure. He's came out with a few new ones and he's, it's awesome. Um, we'll go with Kobe Bryant's death is probably huge right now, which was terrible because he was a great influence in not only the sporting world, but everyday world. The biggest event in the news right now is probably the snowstorms. Um, not in Florida, but definitely, definitely freezing to Dallas and all that. Um, yeah, I think, absolutely. I think I'm going to be more confident every year because um, I'm going to learn more. Uh, yeah, absolutely. You know, I, I feel like I've got a clear plan of, you know, what to do and, and uh, feel more prepared than, than last year. You know, I didn't really know what was going on last year, whether I was, you know, going to be on the team or not and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, this year I have a whole year under my belt, so I feel like I know a lot more. Um... Yeah, I mean, I do. I have some things that I've um, been successful with, but obviously I want to become more successful. Um, no, not yet. I think just continuing to progress, um, continue to learn more, and obviously my numbers say a lot. I don't want to be successful because of my numbers. Um, obviously off the field, I think I can be an impact in the community, have people, have more kids look up to me and you know, eventually say I want to be like you know, Brady. Uh, I think uh, not only a lot of wins for, uh, for myself, but for the team too. You know, I, we're obviously really excited for the season. We had a great off-season signing and a lot of new guys, so we're super excited. Probably nothing too crazy. Just keep on the same path. Don't ever veer away from the path. Don't ever veer away from what you believe in or, or veer away from the things that have made you successful. I think just, just keep trying to learn and keep trying to prepare the best you can. I mean, you. you you can never stop learning. Uh, there's so much to learn in this game and, and just never, never stop. Competing at the highest level in the, in the big leagues and helping Kansas City, you know, get to the, get to the next level and eventually a World Series in there somewhere with Kansas City. Sitting right here doing it again. You know, I, I, I love Kansas City and I love being a part of this team and it's exciting for the years to come. You know, we're looking forward to a lot of big things. Yeah, so I, I, I got a dog. I just bought a dog. It's probably a most likely a proposal coming this off season, I'm sure. Um, did not get engaged. We're still working on that. But uh, no, I got a I got a house this year. But plans in the future, uh, nothing nothing crazy. It means a lot. I mean, I think I think there's so many organizations that people are like, oh, this is the best. Uh, ours is great. I truly believe that the Royals organization is incredible, and I think that because of the family style. And all these coaches, there's no one that thinks about themselves. They pour into every single one of their players. To be raised Royal, I mean, it's an, it's an incredible organization. It's something that I want to be a part of for a long time. You know, since, since day one that they've drafted me, they've promised me um, that it's a family and that we're going to win. And so far, it's obviously definitely a family. Um, and we're going to win. There's no doubt about it. We're excited. Um, I think everybody's excited.